Hey guys, so I've come on here tonight to share with you a haul from various places. Um, I did record uh, the first bit of this, but I've deleted the footage. I don't even know how or whatever. So I haven't got the packaging for some of it. Um, but I'm going to share with you these rolls of washi tape I picked up from um, the range. There were eight in a pack, I think, and I have actually rolled them out into one of my journals. So let me get that and I'll show you which I thought was a better idea. So there we go. So I picked up some Craft Sensations hol holographic washi. You get, yeah, eight in a tub. And I think I paid like three pound or two pound 50 for the tub. So I picked up them. Then from Wilco's, I picked up another pack of washi. Um, again, there was five in the pack. There's three there. I've put the other two away. I don't even know where. <laughs> um, but yeah, I rolled them up there just so I can see what they look like on paper. And they were only £2.50, I think. So I got them. Then from Craft Stash, I picked up this everyday journaling stamp. So you've got, obviously, the months, the days, and then you've got them shortened there, day, week, month, year, and, like, little punctuation marks and things like that. From Wilco, I also picked up this budget planner. I have done a video on this budget planner, so I will link that in the description box below. Two pound, no, three pound fifty. This was highly recommend it. Even comes with a pen loop, and is undated. Like obviously, it starts from January and whatever, but is undated. So if you wanted to start next year, you know, is always there. Um, I got some bits from AliExpress. I'll show them to you in a bit actually. Then I picked up this invisible tape. Now I see people sticking um vellum i want to get some vellum and some foiled acetate in that and i see them sticking it into their journals with just tape and sellotape i didn't think would work so it says invisible tape but i don't know how that's gonna appear on paper so we'll soon see i haven't put it to the test yet i then picked up from amazon this pip sticks workman so many stickers so 2500 little stickers for your big life for planners snail mail love notes and more and i have used a few of these already some of these stickers i won't use but it was i think it was on offer 5.99 and for 5.99 for 2500 stickers and it's by pip sticks as well i thought yes please so gorgeous rainbow ones some butterfly ones some roller skates and disco balls and socks. Now the socks are handy for laundry and things like that. Don't know about the roller skates. <laughs> um, as you can see, I've used some French fries there. You've got pretzels, pizza. So these are handy for food and meal prep. You've got little cactuses. You've got the phones. Now this phone reminds me, anyone from the 90s or grew up in the 90s, did you have Dream Phone? I used to love that game and Party Mania. So that reminds me of that, you know, when you used to have to phone the number and find out if it was your date. Then we have some cute little cats, some stars, moons, planets, some lips, question marks, some cute hedgehogs, absolutely love them. Some stationary bits, some shoes fruit, some uh, records, record players, a cassette, cassette player, some flowers, nails, nail varnish, cakes, so, so ideal for birthdays, backpacks, that could be for school or vacations, vacations, I sound American now, you know, for your, your holidays, <laughs> jewels, cars, that reminds me of like cars from like Greece or something, or um, Herbie, is it Herbie? Yes, okay, nah, over it. So, meh, sushi, I hate sushi. Blah. Then you've got like rucksacks and suitcases and things like that. Again, for your holidays there. Seashells, sloths, for me, love, love, love these cups. Yeah, you just got loads of pages of different stickers. A quicker flick through because I got a few more sticker books to get through. The next thing I picked up was a happy planner. I've been debating on this and I had some Christmas money, so I thought, you know what, I'm just I'm going with it. I'm getting a happy planner. And after seeing um Tracy's happy planner, I thought, you know what, I love this. I love the you know the rings here and they got love hearts down the center it's a 12 month and it's undated as well it's a vertical layout it says happy day on the front oh, 
and it says this happy planner belongs to and it says hey babe i haven't opened it yet because i wanted to do a video so let me just snip this off there we go so you've got your months you can start whenever you want you've got your dashboards there you've got notes birthdays important dates your monthly and then your weekly is there and because it's undated and even the tabs are undated you can start when you want to start so if i don't want to start this till i don't know july or something i can so that's why i love about the happy planner i do want to get a happy planner punch but it's proving difficult you know so i don't know we'll see and then my aliexpress order now i ordered this aliexpress order from the same seller um on christmas eve i ordered this christmas eve night i done a little order because i am obsessed now i seen gina who is g here on youtube i seen a haul these and they're called the let me Sumiko samiko garashi samiko garashi and it's japanese and i just thought they're super cute and basically what it means is in the corner like and the little animals i like to live in the corner <laughs> Um, they don't like socialising, they don't like being a centre of attention and I just thought it was so cute. I think there's 15 different characters in total, I don't know them all, but yeah, I'm obsessed with them. So this was a full pack of stickers, you had the four and I think it was 150 for these four. So you've got some cute little ones and I love them. They stack on top of each other, they stay in the corners, just so cute. And look at that watermelon one, sorry about the glare. And then this one I love because you've got all books and once the stickers are off here, so... Like obviously the stickers are not stuck to the cardboard but what i thought i could do is use this bit because look i could use that bit then for a bookmarker i thought it'd be really cute laminate it cut this bit off laminate it and have it as a bookmarker or like a planner dashboard or something so i picked up them i picked up some washi tape again in the same um same theme i think it's the same theme so it was just super cute. I love it. Absolutely. I'm obsessed with washi tape. I've been trying to look at simply gilded washi tape and that, but it is so expensive. So I'm like, okay, I'll just stick to, you know, <laughs> what I know for now. We got Samiko Garashi seal bits. So there's 40 pieces in here. I love that. It's like a juice carton. And you've got eight designs and 40 pieces. So there. I love this little. So this is a dinosaur, but he pretends to be a lizard. So... And then you have, who is it? This one here. So he's 1%, 1% meat and 99% fat. <laughs> it's just so funny. I, I Google searched it after I seen Gina's and I was like, okay, these are super cute. So I bought these sticker books. Now there's loads of pages in these and these were about two pounds something. Now when, I don't know if anyone knows this, but when you put stuff in your AliExpress basket, uh, it automatically adds postage for each item if the seller is charging postage but when you actually click on the items and um like go to checkout you get a discount for postage so you don't actually pay that big amount of postage you don't actually pay like this said i think 175 per item initially when they were sat in my basket but once you click the items to go to checkout it gives you a discount for shipping so um i think i paid about two pound fifty postage for it all then so you've got four sticker books i picked up the four 335 stickers i'm presuming because it's in japanese and obviously i don't speak japanese but you've got some cute stickers so how many pages of stickers are in here 16 pages of stickers so again you could use the dash these as dashboards look just so cute look at him so he's a dinosaur and he, he thinks he's a lizard i just think he he's my favorite i think you've got little cute ones food ones pencils there just they're just friends and they love to stay in the corner and stick together look at that with the ice cream so these are like stamped like as you can see they're like stamped looking ones got two pages then of that one so yeah super cute and then you've got this last page i'm presuming you can pull it out and just stick it in your book i don't know what it's meant to be but it's cute we have this stick book and each stick book is different stickers in each one. So again, so cute. Look. So stinking cute. I'm just, I'm obsessed with them. 
and I'm not gonna lie I think I paid about two pound or two pound 21 per book oh look you've got some Christmas ones there so and for the amount of stickers you get and the time the delivery took you cannot go wrong on Etsy I've seen some UK shops selling these for six pounds something per sticker book so again we've got different ones here look Halloween ones super cute it's currently like half one I think in the morning I don't sleep so I thought you know what I'm gonna come and film a video why not film a video when you can't sleep hey eh? I finished as well Sophie Kinsella's Christmas Shopaholic book absolutely loved it so I'm gonna start my next one tomorrow I think you've got big um, boxes as well so these would be good for the happy planner got little foods there takeaway foods some watermelons some Christmas ones again some stamped ones or like a countdown just oh they're so cute I really do love them they do everything in this like um, brand as well which I think is cute I'm just obsessed with stickers. I don't know if you can t tell, but I am obsessed with stickers and washi. That's my that's my new uh, love in life, stickers and washi. So, yeah, I can't get enough of stickers and washi. I, I, I honestly got so much art. Oh, I got Etsy orders coming soon. Wait till you see. Oh, yeah, I've spent my Christmas money wisely. I still have Christmas money left as well, so I'm really chuffed about that. But my husband thinks I've been a bit frugal because I'll spend, like, literally, I'll find, like, obviously I don't go to sleep now. We probably won't go to sleep till about four and I'll be on my phone shopping and I probably won't buy nothing. I just, <laughs> I don't know. I just, I like browsing and seeing everything and oh, I just want everything. That's the problem. So that's why I'm a bit frugal. It's not the fact that I'm being tight. It's the fact that, you know, I'm worried if I buy something, something else is going to come along and I am going to really have to buy it. So, <laughs> but I don't know. I'm trying to be good anyway. So yeah, I hope you like this video and please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and take care guys. Thanks for listening to me blabber on you know <laughs> obviously this video ain't gonna go up at one o'clock in the morning or half one whatever but yeah i hope you're all okay and staying safe obviously the news today that um england have gone into lockdown my kids actually went back to school today not physically they done online classes today they started back to school today we're in wales obviously and um, we've been in lockdown since the 20th but yeah it's just our kids done their online classes today so i'm glad they've got their online schooling still but it's just, you know, I thought seeing the back of 2020 was going to be great and everything. And I obviously know COVID is still there, but I don't know. It's just, it's depressing, isn't it? You know, I just wish everyone to stay safe and hopefully, you know, we can get through this all together, honestly. So take care, guys. Bye.